Hey guys, surprise, surprise, surprise. It's me, it's your girl, Miss Fighting Fiercely, Michelle Ann Johnson, and I am dropping in for just a quick second to share some really exciting news with you guys on this March 10th, 2020. We are about a week and a half or so into our National Endometriosis Awareness Month, and I really hope that you guys are enjoying the information that we've put out to you guys so far. I hope that you're being educated, enlightened, and empowered by all of the videos and the articles and the blogs and the podcasts podcast that we are sharing with you and I hope that it's really helping you guys to share with your friends, your family, your co-workers, anybody who could benefit from the information because this is our month, this is our time where we really go in and go hard and getting the word out and spreading awareness for those of us who suffer from endometriosis obviously not just in March, but of course all year long. So I'm jumping on today to ask you guys a question and give you guys a surprise. So for those of you who are checking us out right now, do you guys know what today is? Anybody? Anybody? Well, of course, it's March the 10th and it's one of the days in our Endometriosis Awareness Month, but do you guys, specifically my Chicago peeps, do you guys know what today is? No? Well, if you don't, let me remind you guys that today is the official Endometriosis Awareness Day as recognized by the city of Chicago. If you guys remember a few months back, I posted the proclamation that was approved by our then new mayor-elect, um, Lori Lightfoot. And this is a proclamation that we got in the mail recognizing today, March 10th, 2020, as Endometriosis Awareness Day for the city of Chicago. And this was a really huge step for us in expanding and broadening our reach and education efforts for those suffering with endometriosis. And if you also remember, we did put in a request to receive a, pro a proclamation from the state of Illinois as well. And not exactly sure what happened. Our request, I think, slipped through the cracks and we weren't able to get approved um, at that time. But I just want you guys to know that today, Bam! We have received our official proclamation from Governor J.B. Pritzker that today, March 10th, 2020, is also the officially recognized Endometriosis Awareness Day here in the state of Illinois as well. This thing is huge, you guys. I mean, it's really like old school scroll action going on here. Um, but yes, he signed the proclamation. We were approved um, last month, but I wanted to hold on to this so I can share it with you on the day today, officially Endometriosis Awareness Day um, in the state of, of Illinois, and both the governor and mayor state in their proclamation that they encourage all Illinoisans and Chicagoans to participate in this observance. So this was really a huge feat, you guys. I worked really hard and I've got to thank um, my partner and friends over at the Chronic Disease Coalition for which you guys know I'm also an endo patient ambassador and volunteer with them as well. They were really instrumental in helping me craft the language of the proposal and making sure that I had all of the key informational elements included so that we can get our approval. So join me in celebrating you guys. This is huge, huge, huge. Share with everybody that you know, let them know, and then drop down in the comments and let me know what are you guys planning to do to mark or to celebrate this very, very significant day for us in the Indo community in both the city of Chicago and the state of Illinois. Tell you what I'm going to be doing. I am going to be a guest speaker on our Indo bestie, Samantha Balk. You may have heard, uh, I know you've heard me talk about her before. She's the author of living with endometriosis she also has a chronic illness support podcast and your girl miss fighting fiercely is going to be on the podcast today as a guest sharing my experience and my journey with endometriosis if you guys um click on over to the Facebook page, the Fighting Fiercely Facebook page. You'll see the link posted. So I hope that you guys will check that podcast out as well. The other thing I'm going to be doing to celebrate today is I'm going to be finishing with the editing for the newest episode of Endo Eats so that I can get that out to you guys um, later on today. So that's it, you guys. I just wanted to hop on really quickly to share our big news that Endometriosis Awareness Day is officially being recognized in both uh, my great city, Shy City, and also in the state of Illinois. So thanks to you guys for always supporting and for helping. It's because of you um, that I was able to make this happen. So I'm really excited about that. 
Chime in on our Facebook page, our Instagram page, our Twitter. Hit us up. Let us know what you guys are doing to celebrate Endometriosis Aware this month. I'm looking forward to hearing all of your great information. And also continue to follow all the social media pages for all of the great info that we are going to continue to drop as we move through this amazing 2020 National Endometriosis Awareness Month. As always, you guys, be educated, be enlightened, be empowered, and most of all, keep fighting.